the world has created institutions for a dispute settlement. And the ICJ is one of those institutions. South Africa has not done anything unusual by going to an institution which has been established by the United Nations for dispute settlements between nations. And we're following uh, rule of law and legal principles in this regard. That's the first point I want to make. The second point I want to make in relation to substance. Supporters of Israel, of course, uh, including uh, the, the UK, will we'll say our application is nonsense, but there's global support for our view that, in fact, our case was substantive and we've argued our case. But you don't argue, or do you argue, that uh, with Lord Cameron's assumption that he takes the view that Israel is acting in self-defence after the attacks on the 7th of October? Do, do you agree that Israel was acting in self-defence? We, we agree that the provocation on the 7th of October uh, by Hamas... Israel had to respond to it, but we're saying the response is disproportionate in, in the manner in which Israel has, has conducted itself, and, and therefore its effect has been on innocent civilians, uh, children and women in, 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 in the Gaza. By often, interesting enough, and these attacks have not only been in Gaza alone, including West Bank, and I find it strange that people are saying this is a response to Hamas, which is largely located in Gaza.